Today, I have something special that you've probably not seen on any other VR YouTube channel yet. It is the Pico G2 4K headset. And in this video, we're going to unbox it. I'm going to give it a first face on try and you're going to learn all about this and all this goodness is coming up. Hi and welcome to MRTV. My name is Sebastian Ang. If this is your first time here, if you're just as excited about VR and Ares Me, then subscribe now and click on the bell button so don't miss anything. So this is it, the brand new Pico G2 4K standalone VR headset. Now probably you've not heard all too much about it because it is not meant to be bought by you, the consumers, it is meant to be bought by enterprise customers who need a VR headset for their customers that is able to display VR in a very high resolution. So this is a standalone headset with a Snapdragon A35 processor, the same processor that's also in the Oculus Quest, but this here comes with a 4K display. So the resolution is much higher of that of the Oculus Quest, for example. Now. I'm going to unbox it for you and during unboxing I'm going to tell you all that you need to know about the Pico G2 4K and here we go. So here it is. This is the Pico G2 4K and it's a standalone headset, a 3 degrees of freedom standalone headset. So not 6 degrees of freedom like the Oculus Quest, so more for video playback and these kind of applications. And therefore, you also have a very high resolution display here, 3840 pixels times 2160 pixels for both eyes on one display. So unfortunately, there is no IPD adjustment here, just like on the Oculus Go. So let's have a look at the controller here first. And it is one controller, tracks with three degrees of freedom. And here we have a trigger, as you can tell. With a click, we have a trackpad. We have two buttons here. It runs on two AAA batteries that actually come with the device that I didn't show you here. And also on the side, we have a volume rocker here. And that's everything about this controller. Now let's have a look at the headset, the Pico G2 4K. And well, here in front, we have some cloth-like material, so not metal like on the Oculus Go, and it makes it so light. This is so light, less than 300 grams. It is truly incredible how light that device is. And this here, the back part, actually, this is the most heavy part of the device. So. Actually, this is where the batteries are located and they actually call it like a counterweighted design and it makes so much sense and I'm looking forward to try that later for you. Here on the side, we have the Pico buttons and a confirm button so you don't need to use the controller. You can also use the buttons on the right side of the headset. And now here on the bottom, we actually have speakers. And these speakers are not directly channeled to your ears. So it's going to be interesting to find out how well they work. Then we have here a volume rocker. Then we have a 3.5 millimeters audio jack. We have the micro SD slot, very important. We have a USB-C connection and we have the on off button here. Yeah, so Let's have a look here at the straps. And here actually it says like this is a cable. So this actually is the power cable that connects the headset with the battery compartment on the back. And here we go. And we have some additional straps. So on the top, we have the power cable and then there's an, an additional strap to be on your head. And yeah, the, the back compartment definitely is heavier than the front compartment. And here, this part here, the part that touches your head, you can also actually get rid of it and probably 
probably there are different sizes for it, but this came with this standard size headband. I'm going to try it without it because, well, my head is kind of, kind of big. So let's look at the lenses. And that's also one part that's important about every MRTV unboxing video. Have to get rid of the protective foil that covers the lenses. And here we go. Oh yeah, the most satisfying thing. Love that noise that this makes is great. And these lenses seem to be Fresnel lenses. They are kind of big as compared with other lenses. So that should make up for a very nice picture in VR and definitely looking forward to try that out for you in the full review. And here is the face padding. It's made of some kind of PU leather kind of material. And if you should sweat, you can easily wipe it off and you can get rid of the whole thing and exchange it. So this is so well made. It's made for enterprise customers that use these headset for lots of customers at the same time. And yeah, you can simply get it off, replace it, or you can wipe it clean. It's very, very well made. And yeah, let's see how it feels on my face. So that is the part of the unboxing. So that was the unboxing part of the Pico G2 4K. But as you know, on MRTV, always with every unboxing, there's the face on trial. And now I'm really excited about this because, well, this part here is really heavy. And I believe that this part here, the back part, actually houses the battery. Because this here seems to be a cable, actually, that goes into the headset because the headset itself, this part, the front part, is incredibly light. So we know with the Oculus Quest, it's kind of front heavy because everything is in this part, but it seems for the Pico G2 4K, they have changed that and I'm now really looking forward to put this on here for the first time. Again, this part is so light. And here we go. Wow, okay. I see what they're doing here. So this is truly interesting because this heavy part here is in the back and you can't really feel the weight. But for, for this part, it's absolutely not front heavy at all. And it is so light, it's incredible. So also the part that touches my face, it is, it is not as slim, it is kind of, it's kind of thick, so there's a lot of, there's lots of space here that touches my face, which is better. So then, yeah, well, you don't have really these, these very huge red lines that you normally have. So, wow, I can tell you the first impression, the first face on impression, this is extremely, extremely comfortable. And yes, this is hands down more comfortable than the Oculus Go and also the Oculus Quest in direct comparison. Actually, there's really no comparison because this is really light. And well, thanks to, to, to the back part being this heavy, that is truly, truly impressive. I have no problems also with nose here, nothing. There's no contact at all. So, yeah. As what the comfort is concerned, this is a winner. So I'm very, very much looking forward to give this the full review, to check out actually how is the playback, how is movie playback, how does any kind of content look here on the Pico G2 4K. And um, yeah, I believe this could be a fantastic headset for all the businesses out there who want to give their customers the best picture in VR and that do not necessarily need six degrees of freedom, but who are more about the playback. Wow, cool. Very, very much looking forward to the full review of the Pico G2 4K here on MRTV. Yeah, so that's it for this unboxing. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If yes, give it a thumbs up. And of course, if you haven't subscribed, 
to MRTV yet, why don't you do so now? Because then you will not miss the full review, the full MRTV review of the Pico G2 4K. And that's it. And I'm looking forward to see you in the next episode.